In this video, we will discuss comparative negligence. The rule in comparative negligence is that a plaintiff's damages in a negligence lawsuit will be reduced or even eliminated based on the percentage of his own carelessness. Let's say Perry is being careless by playing a video game as he crosses a street. Here comes David, who is going too fast on his skateboard while listening to music. And David slams into Perry. Perry has $100,000 in damages and sues David. And let's say the jury decides that David is 60% responsible for the accident. And Perry is 40% responsible for the accident. The jury decides that Perry was also careless. Perry's own carelessness contributed to the accident. And the traditional rule of contributory negligence would be that Perry gets nothing. But the traditional rule of contributory negligence is no longer the law in most states. Most states apply comparative negligence where we compare the defendant's degree of fault against the plaintiff's degree of fault. Perry's degree of fault was 40%, so his damages are reduced from $100,000 to $60,000. Many states modify their rules of comparative negligence. For example, in some states, if the plaintiff is 50% or more responsible for his own injuries, then he cannot recover damages in a negligence lawsuit. If you'd like to discuss comparative negligence or any other matter related to U.S. law, stop by the message board and please visit my blog. Also, submit your comments below and feel free to send me an email.